Hey! Welcome to my another brand new After Effects tutorial. I am Karthik here, and today we are creating this. Open After Effects and create a new composition. Here I rename it as Cinematic Title. Here I am using 1920 into 1080 resolution. At first create a new text layer. And type the text you want. Select color and align it to the center. Here my anchor point is here, so I will place it to the center of the composition. To make that, select the text and click on layer. Then select transform and click on center anchor point in layer content. Then select the text layer and press S to open scale. At first frame increase the scale like this and go to 5th frame and set the size to around 75%. Now select the text layer and press T to open opacity option. Here press Alt and click on stopwatch icon to add expression. At expression type. Wiggle open bracket and type 18 comma 20 and close the bracket. And this is our animation looks like, you can see the flickering effect. Now let's add blur at the beginning. So open effects panel and search for fast blur. And add to the text layer. Go to 2 second and create a keyframe at blurriness value 50. And go to 4 second and set the blurriness value to 0. And this how it looks. Now let us make it to look more attractive. Open effect and presets and add glow effects to it. Leave the values unchanged. You can actually see the glow effect here. Add fade dip black effect to add fade at the beginning. At first disable the pre-applied keyframes and at the first frame create a keyframe. to 2 second and set the value to 100% completion. Now this is our animation looks like. If you like to add other text like this simply duplicate the first text layer. Same effects will be present in the duplicated layer also. Now I will hide the first text layer. Simply change the text, its size and its color you want. And don't forget to place the anchor point to the center of the composition. Now half of our animation is completed. This is how it looks. Now let's add light leaks effect to it. 
Select both the layers and right click on it. Pre-compose the layers. Now create the new solid. Let it be the default color. And I will rename it as Light Leaks. Add fractal noise effect to it. Add fractal type select dynamic progressive and at noise type select spline. Set the contrast to 250 and brightness to around minus 75. Open transform menu and add complexity set the value to 1. And increase the scale value around 650. At evolution press Alt and click on the stopwatch icon to add expression. At expression type, time star 300. And we got the light leaks effect. And at mode. If you didn't find this mode option click the toggle option here to get it. Now at mode select add. This is how our animation looks like. Let's decrease the opacity of the solid layer. Go to first frame and create the keyframe. Set the value to 0 and at 2 seconds set the value to 60%. Now our animation is complete. If you like to change the color of the light leaks, just add hue and saturation effect to the solid layer. Select the color eyes and change the value of the hue and saturation. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Till next time, I am Karthik and this is Graphic. Thank you.